Hey guys, my name is Megan and welcome to this video. As you can tell from the title, today I'm going to be doing another All My Pets video. My very first YouTube video about two years ago was a All My Pets video and I think I also did one in November. But I'm going to be doing another one for you guys today because somebody asked for it and also I think I should update you guys on what pets I currently have. We are going to start with my smaller animals, like my fish, and then we will go up to my bigger animals, like my dog. And I will be telling you, like, their age, where I got them from, stuff like that. So this is my brother's tank. I believe it is around 2.5 gallons. And I will be showing you what we have in here. This is their fish, Jacob, their betta fish, and he is around two years old, I think, and he used to live in a really, really small tank, but we upgraded him to this over a year ago, at least, and he's doing pretty good. And we got him from Pet Supermarket. You see that brown dot over there? That is... Their snail, Bob. And we got Bob around a month ago. Um, I made a video on it. And we got the name Bob from a video game that my brother and my mom used to play. And, you know, he doesn't do much. He's a snail. All he does is roam around a tank and eat algae. So, yeah, that's Bob. We got Bob from Pet Supermarket. Yeah, we got it from Pet Supermarket. And now I'm going to show you guys what's in my divided beta fish tank. And each beta has 2.5 gallons, by the way. This is Luna. And we got Luna at Pet Supermarket on the same day that we got Jacob. So she is also around two years old. And I know that Luna is a boy, but... I didn't know how to tell the difference between male and female betta fish when I first got him. So I ended up naming him Luna, which is a very girly name. So when I first got Luna, she lived in a one gallon tank. And after a while, she wasn't very happy in it because betta fish really need at least 2.5 gallons. So... That's when I got this big tank, probably at the beginning of last school year. And since it was a divided tank, I was able to get Comet over here. So like I said before, we got Comet around the beginning of last school year. So he is a little bit less than a year and we got him from Petland, and he's doing pretty good. He's lived in this tank his entire life, and he's pretty active and pretty healthy, and he's very, very pretty too. I'm going to show you our two snails. I got one snail on this side of the tank and one snail on the other side of the tank. And by the way, we got both of these snails at PetSmart. We sort of got them on the same day that we got Bob. Not really, because we did buy three snails at, on the same day. But one of the snails, which was going to be my brother's, was dead. There was like no snail inside the shell. So we had to go back to the pet store to actually get Bob. So yeah, we sort of got them at the same time. So over here, this is Neptune, and he's a pretty big guy. And all of our snails are nitrate snails, I think they're called. I don't really remember. And over here is, um, that is Pluto. So this is my little leopard gecko, Maple. She is a female, and she is around seven months old. I'm not really sure. I got her 
um, around four, three months ago, and she was four months old when I brought her home, and she's just so, so sweet. She is extremely skittish, but she is still a sweetheart, and I love her so much. I have no idea what morph she is, but if any of you guys have any ideas, then let me know. I think she does have some eclipse in her. And yeah, she's going to be my buddy for a really long time because they live like 20 years, so that's really exciting. And off she goes. Oh, and by the way, I'm sure I'm always making lots more videos with Little Maple in it. So if you guys have any videos that you really want to see with her, then comment like what type of videos you would want to see. So here is my hedgehog, Bailey. He is really, really grumpy right now because I just woke him up from his little nap, but he's gonna go right back in his cage probably after I'm done making this little clip. And I love him so, so much. He's what got me so into animals. And um, he is around two years old, plus a couple months. I got him when he was seven weeks old at an exotic pet store, like an hour away from my house. And yeah, I love him so, so much. He's my little buddy. And he's getting kind of fat. <laughs> and yeah, that's Bailey. So if you guys have any video ideas that include my hedgehog, please comment them because I have made so many videos with my hedgehog that I'm running out of ideas. And now last but certainly not least, we got my dog, Oliver. And he is literally like my best friend. My family, we love this dog so much. He is so spoiled. And literally, I would have no life without this dog. I love this dog so much. He is such a spoiled, spoiled baby. And he is, excuse you, nobody wants to see that. What are you doing? Okay. No, don't like that. Okay, so... Anyway, Oliver is... No! Yeah. Oliver is five years old. He will be five on January 11th. And we got him at six weeks. And we got him from my cousin because her pure breed yellow lab accidentally ended up having puppies. They were going to spay her, but for some reason they couldn't. I forgot why. And while... They were on vacation, their friends were watching her, and she got out of the house, things happened, and she ended up having puppies, and we got one of the puppies. Even though we weren't supporting any breeders or pet stores or anything like that when we got Oliver, Oliver will be the last and the last dog that I do not get from like a shelter or rescue. Because I wish everyone will just adopt dogs. Because there are so many doggies and shelters waiting for homes. So that was the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed seeing all of my four-legged little friends. And if you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And subscribe to see more of all of animals that you saw in this video today. And yeah, I just hope you guys enjoyed. And... Thanks for watching. Bye.